Here's the uh, new quad, the Gecko. As you can see, I've put everything I can inside it. So the battery coming out the back, there's the wires for the battery. And also the wire for the FPV. Um, there's a little 5.8 transmitter, video transmitter. I've got the GPS on the top. I haven't put it on the computer yet. So, um, to set up a GPS. But it does, um, the rest of it works okay. Um, I've checked it all out. Um, there's the video, hang on. If I show you, and if I turn it round, there we go. If you look down in this, is my uh, little monitor I've got set up in the room, in my little flight box. But if you have a look down in the uh, corner there, you can see a voltage and also a timer down in the bottom. That's because buried inside there I have a um, small OSD one of those basic OSDs just gives you voltage and um, a timer pretty much that's it um, I can keep an eye on uh, the battery that way and no clutter or anything else on the screen just um, just worried about the battery on this one really um, because this is meant to have um, a return to home so I don't have to worry so much about it I don't suppose well, let's um, start it up and show you. So, control is over. Oh, you have to be quick as it turns off. So, give it some throttle. And picture. It's all still clear picture is all still clear so that's what I was really after there you go auto shut down again because it's uh, been off for more than five seconds so uh, there you have it I'm pretty happy with that it's all very much contained within the body if you look there at the bottom of it you can see the, the wires um, I've got the 2.4 RC wires coming out of the back and going down into a V because um, obviously mostly you're always uh, underneath these things when they're flying so that's pretty neat the wires just uh, go across the bottom of the arms um, I've still got to put a strap on the GoPro to keep it in place um, it's a bit awkward here because my hands are all tied up but um, I've got the, the fitting on rubber so it's um, and it doesn't touch any of the body so hopefully that should take any of the vibrations out if there is any of the picture but it's um, although they're cheap old motors they've uh, balanced up quite nicely okay thanks for watching